Attack on Titan has a lot of wild, memorable fucking moments. A lot of animes do. But Attack on Titan is different, and I didn't realize how different it was until I saw this one scene. Now before I even break this down, you have to understand, the anime slash manga landscape is very cliche, in a sense that a lot of trope and character archetypes get passed around through the entire medium. With the power of friendship being the biggest trope of them all. You know that when you're watching a scene and the main protagonist's friends are all cheering him on or they're all relying on him to lock the fuck in for a singular moment, that character is going to win the battle. He's going to save the day. And when I saw this scene, I thought it to be no different. Hell, I didn't think Attack on Titan would be different. Attack on Titan seems to be your typical shonen anime slash manga, really up until season 4. But even before that, in season 1, Attack on Titan seems to just be the same run-of-the-mill thing. Insert character has a special power, and that special power will eventually help the characters save the day and their friends. And also, the friends will be there to help back up the protagonists along the way. And you have this really heartfelt moment in Attack on Titan where you see Levi gives Aaron a choice. Rely on yourself or rely on others. And Aaron ultimately picks to rely on others. And Attack on Titan even gives us a gigantic fucking pump fake. We see Aaron's choice and at first we thought Aaron picked wrong. We thought the Levi squad were a bunch of frauds. And it turns out they weren't. The whole entire time it was a plan to lock up Annie and immobilize her to really figure out the identity of the female Titan. But this pump fake really proved to me how different Attack on Titan was. Aaron ended up choosing wrong. The female Titan eventually kills the entirety of the Levi squad. The power of friendship in this context means absolutely fucking nothing. This broke the fundamental of the most common trope and archetype in anime there is. Power of friendship. This was very new for any anime or manga to do just in general. But in doing so, it gave weight to another big anime trope and that is angered fueled transformations. Because of this loss, because of the shame of making the biggest mistake he's probably made in his entire life, Eren transforms into the Attack Titan in one of the most beautifully crafted raid scenes I've ever seen in my life. And it wasn't caused by the power of friendship. It was caused by Aaron's own insecurity to believe in himself that he could get this done. And this inadvertently is probably the reason why Aaron chose to conduct the plan of the rumbling by himself. He didn't want to rely on anyone else because he knew what happened the last time he did. And this scene is truly when I realized Attack on Titan was different. You subscribe, you should subscribe, I think you should subscribe right now. And if you subscribe, and if you subscribe, I'll drop a video. You should really subscribe, I'll drop a video, then we can laugh and like it all. I don't want you to comment or like, I want you to subscribe. So subscribe! Pretty, pretty, please, bro. Please, please.